Hi, Clarinets. Thanks for joining me again. Today, we'll do page number 20. On this page, single eighth notes and single eighth rests. A single eighth note looks like a quarter note, but with a flag or a stem hanging off the top of it. So that flag makes it a single eighth note. And a single eighth note receives half of a beat in two, four, three, four, and four, four time. The equivalent of that in a rest is this single eighth rest, and it kind of looks like the number seven. Well, sort of, but it gets half of a beat in two, four, three, four, and four, four time. Number 70 gives us some practice with the eighth notes and eighth rests. It's called easy eighths, and it's in three, four time, and we'll use our F sharp and our F natural in this exercise. One, two, Three, ready, set, begin. Let's do that again for some more practice with easy eighths. One, two, three. Ready, set, go. Now, did you hear how I played the eighth notes short? They only get half of a beat, so play them short in tone, in sound. Next up is Polly Wally Doodle, an American folk song, and it has those eight, those easy eighth, single eighth notes. One, two, and ready, set, begin. <laughs> B did you use when you encountered the note B in this exercise? Did you play B flat with your first finger or B natural with your second finger? If you played B natural with your second finger, you played the right note. If you played B flat, go back and play it again and change it to B natural so that you have the right tone. Next is a song by Wolfgang Amadeus Mozart and it's the march from a song called the Rondo a la Turca. This is a, a piece of music that we're gonna repeat because of the repeat symbol at the end of, line, of the line, and we've got our B flats. Here we go. Try it with me. Number 72 by Mozart. Ready, set, begin. <laughs> If you'd like to practice that one again, it's as simple as pausing and rewinding and trying it one more time. You can even do it a few times on your own, adding a metronome to help you keep the steady beat. Next up is one of my favorites, and it's a Mexican folk song called La Bamba. It's three lines of music. And in line three, we have some divises I'll play the bottom notes, you play the top notes to make it sound extra special. Here's La Bamba. Be careful of B flats. And one, two, here we go. Rest, rest, rest. 
That one sure is fun to play. And if you play it well, you can try playing it even faster. At the tempo, Allegro is where it sits the best. Lastly is number 74, accent on clarinet. Let's play this last line together. One, two, ready, go. For more exercises like number 74, check out page 42, exercise number 5. That page has some extra challenging ex exercises for you to grow and develop on the clarinet. So I hope page 20 was helpful and that you learned something about the single eighth note and single eighth rest. And I hope you enjoyed playing any of the songs. If you'd like, rewind the video and practice them again. You can only get better with practice. So until I see you next time, keep practicing.